Something you might not know about Canada. Hey Canada, Drew and Jonathan again. Before the break, we promised to tell you about a great movie partnership. Now you might know that James Bond was actually based on Sir William Stevenson, a Canadian soldier and spy, but Canadians also had a big hand in bringing Bond, James Bond, to the big screen in Dr. No. Ms. Moneypenny was played by Kitchener's Lois Maxwell, while Joseph Wiseman from Montreal played Dr. No himself. Yeah, but the real stars of the movie were the producers. And Sean Connery. That's my Scottish accent. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, in fact, Ian Fleming, who wrote the Bond novels, had been told they would never make a good movie. Kind of like people looking at rundown houses and not seeing the potential. Don't. <laughs> but Harry Saltzman of Sherbrooke, Quebec, was positive that the books were blockbuster material. Saltzman spent $50,000 for the film rights, but he only had six months to put the deal together. That's like doing a massive renovation when you only hey, have four if weeks. If I can't, you can't. <laughs> anyway, it was a big gamble, and it paid off. Saltzman hooked up with successful producer Albert Bracoli right before the rights expired, and, well, movie history was made, mostly thanks to Harry. And that's something you might not know about Canada. FYI, I would be a better Bond. <laughs> the suit do not make the spy. I'd still be a better Bond. Mm -hmm. I could take it.